Man, I've got to get used to this once again. It's amazing what a three-week break will do to you. Or how long was it? It was longer than that. Probably a month and a half. I don't even know. How long was it? I just hit the go button and then started asking questions that really I should have. If I really wanted to know those things, I should have asked them before I started this. Okay. Yeah, so you can tell I'm rusty. Okay. See, the thing is, this is just chatting, but plus. Like, there's actually something going on at the same time. Like, I have to keep up with the conversation and... And still, I'd actually solve very hard puzzles. Thanks, Florida man. Also, thank you for your contribution in the... In the recent Shady Files video. It may just be you and me today, says one viewer. That's all right. We can start asking the real questions. All right. No, I don't think that's how you do it. I think you just hit. Oh, is this the only one I saved myself? Okay. Arma three thingy. Excellent. Okay. Um, no, this is, this is the way forward. So. Yeah, this is a very tiny jump. Talked about this last time. So yeah, what is the future of streaming? I don't like the term boomer because that implies like when there was actually a high birth rate. But I, I mean, I'm a boomer in the sense that I'm now old. And I don't know what the kids are doing these days. Like Facebook is increasingly for old people. I guess YouTube is now increasingly for old people. Is everyone, if, if you guys are TikTok, then you're just a worse generation than mine. Um, but at the same time, I mean, to some degree, you know, you want to go where the attention is. Not that attention for its own sake is very hollow and shallow. Okay, so that has to be there. Yeah, and only two lasers. Okay, so those are set. Is there a difference between ticking and talking? <laughs> one is when you actually hit the whatever the 20 second limit for the video is and one when you don't. <laughs> whatever it is make it up and then act like it's obvious and then you just I, I think that's how trends get started right just if somebody has enough clout and attention then they just start acting like everybody knows this and that when they're just making it up mm. why is my phone going off probably I'm getting a twitch alert for my own stream Uh, I saw that. It, you're saying New York Post. I thought it was like the Daily Mail or something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I, I also saw the meme of that article. Because um, there's a really old meme of, of a bunch of stick figures talking. And then there's some, you know, some mamby pamby over here, you know, nagging them or whatever. And then somebody comes up and gives them a huge thumbs up and goes back to the stick figures talking. And they do they do that when they put the article over here. Right. 
Right. What do I always say? I say the root of uh, ideological differences is describing and prescribing. We thought the purpose of the media was to describe, but they don't. They prescribe. They come up with the news in their heads first, and then they find current events that fit their predetermined narrative. I don't know what the conspiracy behind banning thumbs up is. They already, they're already, they're already after this one. Stop being weak. Well, that meme kind of shows it, but it's not. It's so dumb, right? It's targeting the the expression of the thing as the thing itself. Right? It's like to say, you know, to get rid of anger, ban frowning. Like that. That's the level of this discussion now. Hey, hi ho. Hi ho yo. What are we doing? And Thomas J. All right, people are coming in. You know, we were talking last time about how I wasn't sure whether to make. Shady Files 9 next or this other video I have in mind. The more I've been thinking about it more this week and I'm actually thinking it is I do want to do the other video first. It will, I'll probably work on both at kind of the same time but I'll probably I, I think I want to make the other one first. I have my reasons. So I got four blocks, two filters, and that's it. Oh, well, I also got this. So you used to, in earlier versions of the game, you could move this around. Uh-uh. No, not the corn thing. I have a completely uh, different idea. For, like, a standalone video. A one-part series. Just... So, like, you know, my greatest video of all time, the D4 sta Deforestation of Mist, right? <laughs> um, kind of like that, but it would, it would be longer and a more serious point. There's one thing on my mind, and I want to, like, make a case for it and prove that case all in one video. Yeah. Yes, we do. You are gay or bi or whatever. I wa I tend to wander around these puzzles a lot without um doing anything for the longest time. Then suddenly I just do 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 put it all together. I got three straights. Wait a minute. Huh. Does that refer to this? <sighs> okay, so here's red. I mean, red. Here's yellow and green. So this would need red in addition to green. You can't go along this diagonal because there's no... That was the point I was thinking here.
You're a surfer, right? So everyone in Florida does. Or... I don't know. Greek festival. Tell us about the Greek festival. So you see, you got a red laser. Oh, okay. It points that way. Okay. Anything that hits this, you probably need to split that way. But red is here. So you will be doing that, and that's going to hit that. You need blue and green to come in somehow. Let me test something real quick. Just... So if it comes in here, it goes out there. So you probably want it to go the other way, huh? Wait a minute, what if it went this way? Oh, that's interesting. If you direct this straight through here, well, it hits that in the first place, but then when it comes through here, you end up getting all the colors here. That hits the blue. What? What do you do with? If you hit red, it's gonna mess that up. If you hit red this way, oh, this is confusing. Hey, Tom Todd. I probably should have started earlier. But I had some things to do once again today. Okay. <laughs> it probably isn't me. So you could also just do that, and then that it gets put in like that. Without interfering in this other thing. See, then now I got the green going that way. That's a little better. See, the fact of case, you, the, look at the red though. You, it comes in here and hits this. I got no splitters. Comes in here. You need it to go this way. You're gonna have to put red. This is five of eight. That's tricky because in order to hit that back here, you need to do this, but that turns off the red here. 
Like this seals it. This is this is blocked any other way. So you gotta get both red and or blue and green to hit this, but not through here. So this line, I still have two of these. I also need blue to hit this, it's not just red that needs to hit this. Yeah, this gets in the way of the original beam right here. There are no splitters. The only way to multiply a color is out here. I almost feel like maybe, maybe I should just do this. Just allow. Both of those colors through both sides. You know what? Maybe you need all three. Just in terms of setting this up, you can only have red go this way because of that. But I'm thinking... That the splits come later. You need to get as much of every color projected into this puzzle as possible and split them later. Because you don't, you don't have... You only have three... You have two filters and three straight pieces. Out. Actually, even just two, because you got to put one here. Or I did put one there. I don't know if that's the right spot, but... It seems like you got to get it in here as quickly as possible. Oh, that's interesting. So when you got a white beam, you just deflect both of these over here and the green gets through. Why is this not lighting up? It's white and I got a white beam going through. You should be able to add however many colors you want to it. What? I 
I don't understand that, but okay. You guys doing okay? What have I done? I'm still here, right? Seven of eight. And I don't even have these used. Ugh. That looks really nice, except for this. That's the issue. Wait, Sarah plays games? I was not aware of this. Okay, so... See, look at the symmetry. It looks nice and everything. Okay. I haven't even used these two pieces, and yet I don't see a way to spare anything for this. What happened? Somebody lost the game. I don't know what this is. If I don't know what it is, then I can't think about it. I have two pieces to spare, but I got no beams to spare. Uh... 
Oh, this is rough. How do you hit this one back here? See, I'm hitting this all three directions with three different colors. That's nice. This feels so efficient. Not what I said, but all right. But you see, this is why on my uh, scripted videos, not only do I try to enunciate all the syllables, but I put the subtitles in manually. So the actual script is in there and there's no possibility of miscommunication. I can't think of a way to get these other beams free. It feels like ma vapid mind games masquerading as philosophy. <laughs> That's what it feels like. <laughs> oh, there you are. I can't put these in the way of any of these beams because I need them for what they're pointing at now. 
And actually, even the tiles don't even align properly. Right, like this diagonal doesn't meet this diagonal. Like if these were different... If this was colored like a checkerboard, one of these diagonals would be light squares and the other would be dark squares. So it doesn't even... I have vague memories of all sorts of, well, as I described it, vapid mind games going on around me where I quickly didn't care. So did I encounter this? Probably. I don't know. But what I do remember is ending up in many such social situations where it's like, I don't know what I'm, what you're talking about. I don't find it particularly interesting. Everybody's giggling for some dumb reason. Just let it pass. See, this should count, but okay. That is such an awkward distance. Puzzles hard, but they're it's rarely easy.
See, that's so natural to put them like this. Because it lights this up. It lights all those up. Now, for some reason, that lights up there. You've got to let red through some other way, though, because red cannot only go this way because there's no way to get it to go this way. That's why. I don't think Tom has one. I don't know. Is it good enough? <laughs> Still. <laughs> no, spoken words are fair. I mean, the, the current quote is spoken. It's one of my favorite lines ever. So it's going to be up a while. Mm. You're going to lose it if you praise yourself, though. Hey, Moss. That would definitely be the most endearing nickname, but uh, I bet I'll have none of it. I mean, nicknames, you're not supposed to choose your own nickname, but you're also supposed to choose your own gaming handle, and I think those are the terms we're on, so... Colonel Weak Sauce. I mean, frosting. Whatever any of this means. El Pollo Diablo.
The fact that I just put, just dutifully take the the turquoise up to this with just this one. I don't know if that's the right idea. Once you put it in place, it makes a really nice symmetry that doesn't work out. It's a really, really nice red herring. Oh. There he is. Hey, buddy. If these went here... I mean, that's another thing, it's symmetric. It just seems to light everything up, but then... What if you take care of that first? If you just cut this here, and then you put it here, that's it. And we're done. That's puzzle number one. So the I, the trick is don't just let it go through. You hit this at the beginning, then it goes through and hits this and splits everything beautifully as I had already figured out. There it is. And that's the first one. On to J2. But first, my drink is empty. I didn't hear about Alex getting angry, but he's always angry. I will be back.
I did not realize. Yeah, I tabbed out of the game so you didn't even hear the music. I apologize for that. I should remember to get back and tab back into the game. I do not boo are you. All right, so what do we have here? Seven targets. One laser, two filters. So it's going to be a, probably a white laser. Huh. Only six. Nope. It's the purple. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, it's all red and blue. Okay, it's just two. I run around the whole room and I literally do not absorb any of the information. Oh, man. This is chaos. Wow. This is a really hard game, and it's going to throw its absolute worst at me. That line, his overall acting with every line was the best. Rand clearly lost a step in his later years. Someone had to say it. Ooh, that one you don't pick up. So you get a double laser back and forth. So that's probably not helpful. Oh, so the dramatic reading of the greater fool theory. Two blue filters. Okay. So blue gets through while red bends, okay. You can't send purple through a blue. Well, that's something, right? Maybe? It hits all three of these anyway. If I send blue, just hypothetically this one through here, yeah. So it does come out this one and hit this. What remains? This, this, this. Okay, so that's not good enough. I was thinking, yeah, if it finished off all of the um, blues and I could just concentrate on reds, that'd be something, but no. This is obviously not correct. Now 
that's interesting. If you hit this, it comes out here and hits that first. Comes out here and still does all this. So now you've lit up four. Oh, but you don't have this. Oh, because I took it away. Hey, M Moss, did you see the, uh, it's just a yes or no question. Did you see the message I posted in the mod chat? Yeah. Just a little update on that whole situation. So. So. Uh, this. Red has become kind of a. Stray over here. It says five. What am I missing? This one and that one. Mm, I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it. Because I actually do want to follow this. And then you just put the other filter there. I think it does it. Where is it? That's it. All right. Second one is way easier. Okay. On to the third. And also you have to do them in order because the door doesn't open until you... Yeah, I can't get into J4 until I finish J3. All right, J3. See, uh, that's what happens when you guys aren't talking. I solve the puzzles fast. Don't you want to see me struggle? We always talk about the mythical potential one day shitty rage emoji. See, to me, that's a better BRB quote for Tom than the last thing. But. Oh, this is awkward. You've got to put something here. Right? Wait. What? Because this, you can't move, but it wants to send something this way as like an output this direction. But this also has an output this direction. That is weird. All right. So first, let's, we have to do that to get to light that one up. All right, and then something comes out of here. What does this do? Ah, it goes this way, so that has to be red. Okay. But that's forced. This can only be red because once it goes like that, that pushes it out this way and there's nothing to be done there. So that's forced, that's forced.
Tom, now that I've released the Quern video, I will say publicly, I would love to see if you ever came up with anything independently about Mastermind. I feel like there's, there's specific things about that game that could be argued or proved that I'm not sure why they're true. All right. So playing Quern or playing Mastermind? <laughs> Mastermind is pretty late in the game. Um, Frosting got pretty far in the game and he's almost at the Mastermind puzzle and he stopped playing. He's like 70% through. He needs to just power through it. Oh, I just told you how far... Well, whatever. It's no big deal. It's one of those puzzles that's just a puzzle. It's not like, ooh, you know, super plot elements spoiled. I said it in the video. The, the plot is not complicated. Although it is. I do think it's underrated. It's not going to resonate with people, but I knew that there I knew that there was some reason why I was like, why, why is this so interesting to me? But now that I've read Conflict of Visions, I realize Quern and Conflict of Visions have the most neutral approach that I've never seen anywhere else. Like they're both, they both have that exact straight shooter um, approach throughout its entirety. It's really interesting. So I have these two, the most basic two, just those, that, and this. This is this has to be there. This has to be there. If I just do this, that lights that up. But that also seems stupid. Do I have filters? I have. I saw a green one sitting there. Okay, yeah. I only have a green. That's kind of interesting. But then how the hell would you ever get a blue? I mean, a blue, a red on there. I mean, see, it would light those up, but it would kill that, so. This is kind of nice. I mean, you got yellow through here. You just need blue to hit. Does blue hit this? Let me just test it. If blue hits this and it goes, okay, it kills this. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cause you got yellow here. Okay. I just needed to test that. All right. Yeah. Yellow got to come in here. So, oh, you have that. I don't need to split it necessarily, but wait, what? Oh. Is 
See if I hit this. Okay, that hits these two. Hits that. Uh, something's wrong here. There. So now I got this splitter, this useless blue just heading off into nothing. Ah, blue here. These are what I need. Blue needs to go this way. But you can't have that. Blue needs to hit that and that, which that's not how splitters work. Hmm. All right, Florida man. Have a beautiful night's rest. So what are you programming, Tom? can't have blue hitting this. That's stupid. We have to have this filter. Because you need... Yellow has to be hitting this going into this. But it can't continue. Wait. What? Uh-huh. It's over. I did it. Why did that work? Okay, so if I split it this way, it goes in here. What does that do? If the blue goes in here... And it comes out... Oh, it's a cheap way around the yellow. So you get to split the white, but you're going around this. Awesome, Tom. Awesome, Shady. Shady figured out J3. All right. <laughs> hey, nobody cares. Need a, um, there's that, um, that 20th century Fox animation. But they replaced 20th Century Fox with no one cares. Da -da 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 -da. For me, not for Tom's project. Okay, so this, you always wonder if this is like some red herring thing because it seems obvious the purple starts. It's been a very, very long time since I needed to switch the lasers around. The last time I remember that being a thing, it was really obvious that they had to be switched. Um, this purple is pointing directly to purple, but 
There's also a space in front of it. What is the other color? Yellow. Probably not. Hmm. Two of nine. So you got this little grid here. This one. This one. Ah, this one back here. Okay. That can't work because it goes through this. I try to keep the games I play to stuff that I can finish in a reasonable amount of time. I don't think... It took me like 40 hours to get through Outer Wilds. And I feel like that was kind of pushing it. I feel like some of these games are way more than that. I feel like Star Control 2 sounds it sounds like something it would be way more than that. Did somebody ask if there was an evil Tom earlier? Because when I think of Star Control 2, I think of Evil Tom. Not not this Tom. This Tom here is good Tom. So the guy I knew growing up, Alex who looks almost exactly like Tom. It was annoying. It had a fake British accent instead of a real one. Yeah. I am wary of the time sink. All right, J4, last one in this building. This is all right what do we want cutting this way the only color you can have cut this way is green and that hits that one but not even that one Blue cuts through here. Is that good? Cuts this, this, this. That seems fine. I mean... Why not? Because blue, I mean, all of these... These need blue and I don't need it anywhere else. I think blue is done if you just let it do that. Red goes here. What do also need? Some green. If I do double blue, it's fine. It doesn't matter. What does this do? Ah, it cuts this way. You don't want red going this way. Uh, blue is already going. You need green only going this way. Green hits that. There's really nothing stopping. Well, unless something goes there. But you need a red along this back row somehow. I'm just going to do this real quick. Just 
let's see here. If I, was just, if I just go straight in there. Oh. You don't need both red and blue to go through here, but man, it would be, sh it would sure be nice to have red go through here. Blue cutting through all this would take care of this, but having red go through here, you could put this here and it would just cut red all the way through this. So if I could get red cutting through this way. If red cuts through here, it hits this. You got nothing. No way to intervene. Red hits this. Oh, sorry for bumping the mic. This feels right for red and or I mean for blue and green. Why do I always I can't speak the correct colors. What what does that mean? Why does that happen? Oh, is there like a okay we're was it glitches? Was it exploits? I'm not sure I've, we read that this, that comment the same way. Super gamer. So I have a blue filter that allows blue to pass through, but red must bend. See, I could put it here. Oh, wait, wait, why does this get? Wait, what? Comes through here. Oh, this already duh. This already gets red because it's it's a yellow. Wow. Never mind. So this is an interesting conundrum. The, the nature of the puzzle is different than what I thought. But I, I have an extra thing, so it's fine. I didn't realize I had an extra one of these, so this should work. I heard the door open. Nine of nine. We're done. Okay, that's building J, and I'm gonna get an achievement. Should. Oh wait, I went backwards. It's the wrong door. Sorry, wrong door. There it is. All right, but I still have building K, which is, it's either gonna be ridiculous or they're just gonna hand it to me. 
I've only been streaming an hour and 21 minutes, so let's be greedy. Who's up for the next four hours? Me. I bet I can, excuse me. I bet I could do this. Toggle one. Also toggle one. These don't move. Well, obviously that doesn't move. Uh, I don't know what that means, Tom. Isn't that like in three minutes or something? feels like some sort of red herring. Obviously, you can't let it just go all the way to here. Oh, man. Okay. See how that does that? And then if you do, that's what those do. And Tom was never heard from again. It's always after midnight if you think about it. We got four diamonds, two X's, and two triangles. Here are the two triangles, here and here. Two X's, or purple X, oh, purple, I mean a white X here. It reminds me of, uh, old Samwise Gamgee. Out in the bushes. That's a good quote too. 
So the British have the double quote as a shift two. Did you know that? You probably knew that. I, I wasn't aware of that until I accidentally screwed up my keyboard settings. Through some keyboard shortcut, I switched to the UK system. And I was wondering why I was getting these weird outputs. We got a lot of good quotes tonight. We got Sarah's right now. We got we got it most deprecant. So if red, see, if red just cut across here, like imagine red just cutting straight through it. See, white, yellow, purple, white. See, red is fine here. And then it just hits this naturally. And it could hit this. And you could have a turquoise go straight through this. Aw, oh, yeah. See, that seems, that seems valid. See, I keep also looking at this this line, this horizontal line, and thinking it's something, but it's not. So that's not it. Wait, hold on a second. Okay. Yeah, we're good. We got a red. That lets red to pass through. See, that's white, though. I don't like all this shit in my way. Okay. See, this is backwards. It allows red through and blue because and blue and green go that way. It's, we need the opposite. Yeah, what are these keyboard modes? Oh, that Alex character that liked Star Control 2 so much growing up. He he used Dvorak. He was the only person I knew that actually used the thing. So yeah, teach me, educate me. What are all these?
I think I've seen a Zerd E. But I don't know who. I, mean, I don't know where it comes from. This is hard to just look at it and it's it's also hard to experiment with too though. I should just take a look at this. See, that's, that's all of the diamonds right there. But then I need to be able to toggle. See, what it is, I got three symbols. I got diamonds, I got X's, I got triangles, and I got three doors. They don't all have to be open at the same time. These with the little one on them toggle. in different directions. Yeah, I, I always hear the story about QWERTY being designed to slow typists down. Okay, that's fine and all, but it's obviously, if there was some puzzle like, what is the optimal poor design to get people to type as slow as possible? You don't put the Q on the upper left. Right? Whatever the optimal slowest typing scheme is, it's not QWERTY. Right? It's, it's gonna, it would be some hedge in the middle. That still wouldn't be the slowest. That's <laughs> right. You don't have to use Q that often. It doesn't matter what you do with Q. It matters what you do with E, which it's, you know, it's not really that far out of the way or T, right? If I had to move my little pinky up every time to hit the T, like imagine that. Imagine if the T was where the Q is. That would be ass. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Super Gamer. Like, it's some kind of middling problem, yeah. So, I do cut...
read through all this. I think that's correct. For the X's, I need blue and green to hit this and just blue to hit this. How do I even get that? Ah, here we go. This separates blue. So you got to separate I finally got a, a controller so I can maybe when I uh, boot up Outer Wilds again I'll try it on the controller I played it on the keyboard before but and I need I still haven't played the DLC there are a lot of games I need to return to although unfortunately Outer Wilds is one of those games I look at the achievements like the, the achievement list is like nah that's not that's not one of those games you hundred percent It's got the same song twice in a row. Um, No, you can't filter out a color because you, you have to hit this ultimately. Unless there's some other configuration where you bend it over and back, which hopefully not. Let's see here. Here, 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 right here. So I need one strand of white to get through here.
think that's confused me. Okay. So that once again in sort of a roundabout way gives me the four diamonds once again. But now I also got one of two of the X's, right? Because I split up the blue and then rejoined them. Um, the other X, though, is here. And that's nowhere close because it would need... It would need a turquoise, but there's a turquoise right here. So I could probably put one of these here, huh? Right, so like in this form, if I, okay. Four, four, diamond, one of two X's. But if I flip this. In, I now have two of two X's, right? Because th that's how this works. It, it moves one or the other. You toggle it. So if it goes this way, I get the diamonds. If it goes that way, I go get the X's. That's the point. So I need to do a similar thing with the triangles. Which is here. That needs a green. Which I only see a green here. Ugh. And this needs both colors. Ugh. Am I even close to this? I have a splitter still. See, if I look at this. Hmm. So I got a lot of tools left. Oh wait, what is this? What? What could this possibly be used for? Can't really be used this way. What about this way? Ooh. If you theoretically had a blue coming in this way, that's a real mess because this square, this square, this square, they're not compatible at all. You usually want to be a little more efficient than that, but who knows? Maybe that's what you have to do because I do have a lot of pieces here. See, if I use this and hit this, then I suddenly got this. Okay. 
Okay, it still hits that. You just don't hit that because... That's just not what that does anymore. What if... This way is X, this way is triangle. What if instead of a... Uh, sorry, I don't want to put that there. I have a second splitter, right? Yeah. Uh, what? So are they opposite? I think they're opposite. You either get this X or that X. No, it's backwards. They don't go together. Um, It just cuts right through here. No, that's no good. Right, because the blue just cuts through here. I mean, that seems really stupid to use both of these like this. Wait, it still doesn't even do it? This is the side that should be hitting both X's, right? Okay. I mean, it can't be this way. There's nothing there. So I'm just in this awkward position where the the two are out of sync.
I'm wondering if there's a thing where... Well, I don't want to re... I don't want to have to revamp that whole thing. But I probably should think about the triangles at the same time too, right? So, thinking... Since there's only one toggle, but there are three shapes. The X's may need to be a constant. So then it's a question of whether the X's are in the left and the triangles are to the right or the reverse. I think I think that was generally the pattern. Yeah, no, you need only blue to go through here, so. If... Ah, it's backwards again. I was trying to think of a way to send green through here. Through the toggling mechanism, right? So, like, one direction... Only blue gets through here and therefore hits this properly, but then here both blue and green gets this way, so then you need this toggle in some other way. So, I don't know. How are you guys doing? You got quiet again.
find that to be an interesting uh experience so you got you have my stream on and you can obviously hear me so you're hearing my game's music and sounds and stuff but you're playing your own game too so i guess you just <laughs> i guess you just turn the sound off in your game or you have everything just you know slamming your earbuds at the same time or should say eardrums not earbuds why would i assume what kind of Probably not. You're probably not wearing earbuds. Callum, Callum is not a name we use in the U.S. It sounds weird and you're weird. Except for me, <laughs> I have pretty generic bland sounds in my games, but I still blast them. Seems like with some games you need sound cues, like, I mean, obviously if you're playing, you know, some kind of shooter game or anything, it seems like you'd want to hear everything going around you, but, you know, obviously you wouldn't be. Well, I would say you wouldn't be in this stream, but actually Frosting was in one of my streams while playing, I don't know. But he didn't care how many times he got his ass handed to him. <laughs> he just came. You need green to go this way? What? You can't just point. That would be absurd. That That's not possible because then you block this one. That would light this up. We also need green here. Ugh, man. I got all the way to building K and now I've been exposed. I'm feeling really silly right now.
How would you get hit green to hit this and this at the same time, but likely not this? So, the one interesting thing about this approach is that it gives you the triangles automatically. Now, the yellow ruins this, but maybe there's something completely different you do. See, like right now, when I put this here, it's only red through here, and here, yellow's through here. All right, Tom. It's very late over there, so yeah, get some sleep. wrong direction why is it always wrong both ways I hate this The idea I'm trying to f figure out here is some way to use the toggle to where sometimes red goes through and sometimes yellow goes through. That would be really nice because then I don't have to... Then I don't have to worry about any other way of getting the triangles. Those would just be done. Although you would have to worry still about You can't just put this in the way though. Then you need sometimes yellow.
need see here yellow gets through and then here red gets through but how do I do that using the toggle I'm going to have to be right back. I got to go to the bathroom.
<sighs> All right, Let's see if I can figure this out. Keep forgetting to turn the music back on. So Moss, you said you were able to meet up with friends. Is uh, your neck of the woods finally returning back to some sense of normalcy or what's going on over there? Seems pretty normal. It's weird, right? Like... Everything's always two steps forward, three steps back, right? Because now, now we've got the... You know... The whole nuclear war thing. Yeah, that whole passports for years to come. It was. You know, it was really interesting when I brought up that thing. Um, I brought up the nature of the, the whole vaccine controversy in my own Discord server. And I had linked that video to that professor talking about the dangers of what was going on and. I got that response from Winter Mafia. It was really interesting because, like, you could tell the nature of the conflict, and you can tie it to conflict divisions, by the way, how one side sees the nature of the conflict fundamental in a fundamentally different way than the other. It's not just a disagreement about, you know, up or down. It's what it's a disagreement about what the nature of the conflict is, right? So... <laughs> yeah. But, man, I, it's my favorite book of all time. It's a very dry book. I mean, like, most people probably wouldn't like it, but I love it. It's my favorite because I feel like it. once you master the, the ideas behind it, you just see the world so like the most baffling scenarios suddenly you see with much greater clarity but yeah it's <sighs> one side will see the nature of the conflict in terms of how centralized the decision making process is and the other will see the nature of the conflict as to whether that centralized decision-making power is making the right decisions or the wrong decisions. And so there's a there's a weird talking over each other's heads problem. But yeah, so like... If you're terrified of vaccine passports... You are fundamentally skeptical of the centralization of decision making. Whereas the other side isn't concerned about that at all. They just wonder if that's the right thing to solve the problem at hand. So then the way they see each other in terms of the opposition, they'll think, well, you don't think that's a viable solution? Well, of course it is. Like, well, then why don't you see the, the problem, the president set by not allowing second opinions? And yeah. Yep.
But I guess what I mean, what I'm saying is like the side that doesn't fear the precedent. And, and I remember because Winter said something specifically that he was like, well, we could just end it all tomorrow if we decide that's the best way to go forward. Like, he was not concerned. He definitely had the unconstrained vision. So, like, you're not... It's like, oh, the threat of vaccine passports for years to come. But if they decide to end it tomorrow, then that's fine too. Or we'll have it for years. Like it's very, it's very kind of in the moment either way. Kind of whatever we have to do. The constrained vision is the long-term perspective. Yeah. I just always find it fascinating how people will speak with such fluency in one vision or the other. Even though they're so opposite. That's weird. Okay, so what I was trying to do here... Is see if I could get either yellow... This is red. Okay, so let's try putting this one here. You're gonna miss this. So I do have this toggling thing. It feels very haphazard though. So I could toggle. Between the triangles and the diamonds. Which one would need the X's? X's. Can't have green go through this, so this is the one that would need the X's at the same time, if you were going to do that as well. <laughs> Righteous asshole moss is best moss. Oh, that's the perfect compromise. Half of each. I think you always have green going through that X. I think that's the problem.
All right. Um, I'm thinking this is probably completely wrong then. Hmm. I wish. Yeah, this is stupid. Yeah, if you got yellow cutting through here, it kills X right here. So it would have to be this way. But now you've got a problem because... There's no way... Terrible. Oh, I'm nowhere close. This is so bad. Hard, hard puzzle. This is the hardest level and the hardest rethink so far. That old, that old phrase. hit the reset button <laughs> clear my mind all right i don't like these here You got a red filter and a yellow filter, and you got a whole lot of tools here. So there's a lot of potential. There's a lot you can do here. I think one of these goes here somewhere, and you just need to shoot a red down this, and it hits this, and it hits that, and that's all you need to do with red. I mean, it doesn't have to be this, right? It could be... You know.
could be this, right? It could have, it could be very powerful, powerful laser beams. Lots of colors coming through here. Although I'm not sure I need it. White includes a red and I don't need any more red this way. See, so, uh, not that. Look at all these tools I have left over. And I already have the diamonds open. So there's gotta be some way, right? I got plenty of stuff to move everything around to hit the other things. So maybe I'm just being timid. Maybe this was actually an easy puzzle if you just stop being a pussy. Guys, what do you think my balance should be between streaming and content creation? You guys just like me to stream. Should I just be a short-term thinker? Because I feel like... Whoops. I feel like... I'm just way underperforming. I could do so much more with my scripted stuff. But I, don't, I always feel bad either way. If I stream too much, then I'm like, but I'm not doing anything with my life. But then when I work on my creative content, I'm like, oh, I miss you guys. I wish I was a twin like the Grinders. I wish there was a second, there was a clone of me. Yeah. Exactly what the issue is. Post scarcity economy, her derp. Nope. The most valuable resource is time. Even if you live forever, people lose their patience anyway. I need both green, blue, both. Thank you. 
See, one thing I could do is I could just put something like this in here. Just get a free beam of white here. Wait, yellow? I don't need yellow. What the? No. that get... Huh? That's... <sighs> Never mind. That's better, because now you get the red coming through like you need, hitting everything it needs to. But now you got, that's it, you got a free, okay. I mean, I don't know if that's the answer, but you know. Probably not. This is your only way of separating the blue You need to be able to separate the blue. You also need to be able to keep them together. You can only separate the blue before the red comes out. There's actually something aesthetic about this. The solutions always end up looking really nice in the end. Um, Dumb tarted. All right. Hey, let's talk politics. We're bored. Actually, we sort of did earlier. We were talking more about medical freedom or something. And we also talked a little, little, little tiny bit about Outer Wilds. And you missed it, Matthew. Also, hello, Matthew. How, how are you doing? It's been a long time since we talked. Uh,
So... So blue going through here. That's all I need. See, now I got blue. I mean, blue. I got X and diamond cut open at the same time. I just need to be able to hit this. and get triangle. Which is both colors hitting this and only green hitting this. Now green. Or is it the other way? No, because you need that. Okay. Who's around on the 29th? That's probably when the next sub hangout will be. I don't think I'm going to do a vote on it. I just had one on the 8th, so. See, the problem is the idea of getting, uh, green here, you would need, you just need green to hit this. Ugh. Lights up two whole doors.
So, what limited I know about you is that I think you prefer the G over the F. I don't think our Florida man cares. But maybe we can make him care. Let's start an artificial rivalry for no reason. Yeah. Ah, oh, you too play Grand Theft Auto. It's my favorite thing. Just go in. That was my favorite. That's always been my favorite thing about Grand Theft Auto. Just, just single player NPCs. Just run around town, punch people at random. I don't even need the high grade weapons. Just start throwing haymakers. Just see what happens. What you really want to do is you want to, you want to punch somebody and then you you keep punch a lot of them will run away but you want one that wants to pick a fight and then you find a cop so then you get them to come at you and you just kind of lead them into the cop so you you then dodge at the last second so they punch the cop and then the cop goes after them right but the cop misses and hits a car and that start that gets that person to get out of the car and that causes a wreck and then somebody starts punching the car for no reason until like the car runs out of HP, which, you know, in Grand Theft Auto logic, it causes the car to explode and then sets a chain reaction. And then the cop will blame some random person. He'll call for backup. It's great. I don't, I don't need to do any missions. It's, it's just about, just, <laughs> it's just about the, the, the wonderful randomness of, you know, unprovoked events. So, so you want to run a vehicle into a cop, but what if you bail out of the vehicle just before it hits? Is the cop still going to blame you? Because you technically weren't in it in that moment. Hmm. This feels good right here, where you set, where you put the two filters right here. Yeah, the Grand Theft Auto Five, the uh, the Grand Theft Auto Five cops, I wouldn't call them smart, but they were quicker to blame. Like if they wanted to ask me a question and ran away, all of a sudden I got two stars. I didn't like that. Whereas I could just park my car in the earlier games. I could just park my car inside one of those spray stations. Stand outside, get out my air gun, shoot everything I want, get whatever, and just jump into my car and clear it and clear the wanted level. Well, thanks for ste stepping back in, Moss. So Matthew had a hit and run. He posted one comment and left. That's the thing you missed.
There he is. You gotta tap him on the shoulder. Wait, what? Moss. I thought you were dropping weight. What's going on, man? <laughs> Jim might surprise you, actually. When I see these different colors, look at this. I got the blue, I got the green, I got the red. That feels right. Everyone gained weight during COVID. I fattened up again. Look at my chin. Oh my God. It's embarrassing. Look at that. That's where the real, like, that's when you know you went too far. When it's, when it's in your face. Fat does not belong in your face. It's all in my stomach though. Yeah, 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 I know, like. Well, that's actually, and, and, <laughs> from a health perspective, that's the worst place to store it. Unlike before, this feels actually right. And I don't want to mess up a good thing. Nah, it's not going to be it though. This is the only tiny, tiny bit of green, though. I didn't know that, Moss. I didn't know you lived in a shithole. And I want to avoid running into my unlicensed pharmacist neighbor's client. Okay, here's what you need. You need... You need... One of two things. You need to... Either... 
you need either a time machine and invest in Bitcoin in 2010 or <laughs> which is true for everyone or you need to follow the Nancy Pelosi stock tracker then you'll be rich <laughs> Which it's an interesting question when it comes to the Nancy Pelosi stock tracker, which is the cause and which is the effect? Is it Nancy? Is it Nancy's legislative work that allows Paul to get ahead of the game? Or is it Paul decides what determines Nancy's legislative work? Who knows? Either way, they're in circles that I will never be in. No, this is bad. You can't eat the one out of two. Moving is good exercise. Stuck on this puzzle. Sorry for being boring. Are you guys okay with me being stuck? I start to get insecure after a while. guys it's very heartwarming and yet you hang out anyway so that's I, I try to create that experience I want I want I want to be able to have scintillating discussions about what was it yeah I've been drinking you know I actually I had beers in a social setting once in the whole time I was off which how long was I away about a month something like that it wasn't that long. So sometimes it may look like I just, you know, I'm just a hopeless alcoholic, but it's not actually true. But I do, it is something that makes me look forward to these times hanging out with you guys. It's interesting. I have this instinct. like, I need to compromise my 
faculties. Well, that's pointless. That doesn't go anywhere. Wait, what is this? No, I need to figure out a way to make use of this. Look what I found. Which, by the way, if you're interested in the puzzles, I will explain the mechanics to whatever depth you wish to know. Although, maybe you're not interested. I don't know. I like what I have here. I like this white coming in here. And these two filters kind of... Then you get these three... You got the three primary colors splitting out like this. That does feel good. If this went like this, it would hit that. Which I don't see an immediate use for it, but it was put here for some reason. Okay, that's the X door. <gasps> okay, that's close. So you say, okay, a lack of familiarity and not defining your time. Also, you're just not playing it. It really is that simple. Like, if you had your fingertips at this to actually experiment, when you have an immediate question, wait, how does this work? And you could just try it. But you're at the mercy of whatever spontaneous bullshit I do. So you don't get to do that. Yeah. So that triangle's done, but I need a green. Ah, that's no good. I need a green here. Look at all of these. One. Wow. Look at this. I have three unused straight pieces, which I bet if I had four, I could solve this right now because... Yeah, I need a green hitting this, but the only green is this little tiny stretch right here. Thank you. 
I know, I, I know you like to talk about how I suck at games, but you know, it really is different when people are watching Matthew. Oh wait, these are being used. Oh, that's even worse. <laughs> uh... I have to remember what that is. Ah, uh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Okay, just had to remember. Yeah, I don't know. Wasn't there some RNG problem? No, it wasn't RNG, but there's something weird going on there. We talked about it before. So I think what I enjoy about the challenge of drinking and streaming while playing games is that the more you compromise your own ability to think and speak, the more you have to prioritize what's absolutely important. And so there's a weird benefit to that as well. You don't need blue coming over here twice.
That's why I did this, because it hits both of those at the same time. But then when I flip it, I get one of two triangles, but I need a green here. That's what I'm missing, but green is only here for a second. And it rejoins here. That's why I was trying to split it the other way. None of this works the way I was hoping. I'm going to have to play that game again sometime. I remember I've all, remember I've only played through it once so my memory is not actually that great although it is a fantastic game Yeah, wow, it's been that long, huh? Is the is this it time flying or just Matthew's reckless spoilers? Hey, is my cat around? There he is. Hey buddy. Yeah, come on up. Everyone wants to see you. Come on. Come on, hurry up. Come on, come here. Joey, come here. He's figuring it out, whatever. Um, so I only have these two actually. Yeah, I just wonder if you, you get bored with me just, you know, struggling with the same puzzle for two hours. But I try to make it more about, you know, more than just the puzzle. I try to talk my way through it, you know, to whatever degree you're interested in it, but. I'm going to teach Matthew a lesson here.
I don't know. Hmm. So you're actually not good at all, Matthew. I, I don't think you understand the point. Are there any mods in here? There are no mods in here. Yeah, but I'm drunk and stupid and a boomer and I don't understand how this fucking platform works. How do I mod someone? Do I, is it forward slash? Forward slash mod. Is that what you do? Let's see what happens. It's probably just going to be a chat, but okay. All right. Did that do it? Type something, Moss. There. You did it. You finally earned your status. Matthew's pissing me off. <laughs> <laughs> you made it. Your life is complete. Stop spoiling games I'm not playing right now. You can talk about them when I'm playing them. It's not just for me. It's for other people. I don't know how to delete a specific message. I can only like ban him and stuff. I don't want to ban him. That's too heavy handed. I don't actually even mean that. I don't even mean like a timeout. I don't even want to time him out. I just want to delete that one message. But I, I don't know how to do it. This is my thumbnail for the stream. Well, my eyes don't focus right now. That's better than me, Moss.
always backwards. I can get either that triangle or that triangle. That's backwards. See that the two, the two toggleable cubes have to move at the same time. Maybe when it moves to the right, it goes to the triangle. And then when that goes to the right, it goes to the triangle. And it goes to the left, it goes to the X, right? And then that points to the X. If the green goes like this, though, yeah, sure, you're hitting this, but then their intersection is there, which is not a spot I can deal with. Now, putting the two toggleable things here to where both left faces the X and both right faces the triangle, that's kind of nice, I guess. Well, you get a gold star if you delete your own spoiler. Tired of you talking about essential plot elements of a game I'm not playing. Because people, you know, it's not just you and me is the only ones here. And people watch the archive and stuff like. If I'm playing the game, people click that link and expect to see spoilers. But if I'm playing something else, they'll be like, oh, I'm going to watch this other game, but I don't want that game spoiled. And then Matthew comes in and randomly spoils the game anyway. Not just for me, right? Somebody might be following my channel and just want to watch some other hangout, but are avoiding the Outer Wilds streams because they don't want it spoiled yet. They want to play it. And so they just join a rethink stream or watch an archive and suddenly Matthew comes in and you know, I may know, but you just start spoiling details, right? It's different. See the problem? What the? Why is there? Oh. Something weird going on here. Okay. So here now, when they point to the right, they hit the triangles. But now this comes over here. I can actually hit both of those at the same time now. Can I hit the other X when they go to the left?
Oh, that is a travesty. Oh, that is unbelievable how close I am to this being solved, but it's not allowed to be solved. You will not have it. I got a splitter here. And yet that's still not good enough. No, okay. It's coming in perfectly to where... Okay, I got two straight pieces and a splitter. And the angle is just perfect to where I cannot get them to align right. Because I need one to aim that way from this column. But the diagonal is in such a way... See, I need that. There's a bug, by the way. I don't know. Well, what's the point of that? Just, you can't see your own messages, but... Wait, that'll do it. I don't think that's intended, but that, I think that solved it. Look at that. When I toggle this, see, those two are good on this toggle, and that one's good on this toggle. It doesn't feel entirely efficient. But it works. Ah! All right, K2. <laughs> That's my persistence. <clears throat> I'll keep streaming. I'll keep playing for as long as you guys want to hang out. Whatever, but I got to be right back for now.
talking to me? No. Oh, look at this. Whenever I think of that game, I think of, um... So, everybody talked about, uh, this Dylan Dow character. It's like, oh, there's Shady Paradox and there's Dylan Dow. And it's like... That's not who I really remember. Like, at the time... It was this person, this Let's Player, her crabbiness, and that was her game. That was her jam. She really loved that game. But I was like, well, I can't watch your stuff because I haven't played that game. I like how everyone's really caught on, really embraced the Florida ma'am man title. Florida ma'am. It's ma'am. Uh, the Florida man title. Um, even though it's supposed to mean something completely different. <laughs> oh, what a weird room. Okay, so four of these, four of those. It would be really cruel if it turns out I need to swap the lasers. Four years ago, that's more recent than I would have guessed, actually. Okay, I mean, so my channel is less dead than other people's channels. Although my my problem is I keep promising there's going to be something down the line, which there is. Ugh. I, I am motivated by my dissatisfaction. But I have a really neat idea for a video that I just, ugh, I really want to make this video now. I've been thinking about it all week and how exactly to pull it off. That dude is weird. <laughs> Nui sons or whatever. I don't know. My complaint with that guy is very different than what he would probably guess my complaint would would be <laughs> bad lighting <laughs> even better oh well if i put this here that lights that up and if I put this here, it lights that up at the same time. Ugh. That's a red herring if I ever saw one. And then you swap them and they go this way. Hmm. Oh, this is going to be weird. Weird, weird, weird. Let's see. I mentioned her. But I didn't look her up. Let's look her up.
Oh, wow. She is almost exactly the same number of subscribers as I do. Okay, let's play. I don't know how to pronounce it. Hatoful. Hatoful. Hat. I don't know. H boyfriend. Part 10. True pudding. True pudding. This is no pudding for a man. Did she finish the game? Oh. Hmm. Ugh. No. No. Never. Never again. Never. Hey, Tech Rock. So blue is the color that's common to both of these. Blue is the common color with both of these, right? So if we're going X, then you need red, which is over here. That's no good. You can't you can't hit this because then it ruins that. If you're trying to hit this X, you can't hit that X. You have to go around it, so... That's awkward. It's a red filter. I put the green filter, it just reflects both of them. You got to split them this way. So red will always get through. Try flipping these. So that's just fundamentally wrong. Unless you back it up, that seems overly convoluted. See, this at least lights these up.
What? What is this puzzle? So Was the message Clear in my video that came out this weekend Because I said it It was just one sentence But it was very Direct I said it Out loud I said the quiet part out loud I said I'm not doing let's plays that is not what I want to do in any capacity. But I do want to make something scripted in like in my own style. And I have different ideas. But I got to get away from that because otherwise you just have the stigma. Because like that... Your friendly boy boyfriend or boyhood or whatever his name is. Whatever his name is, was saying he could make whatever I. Well, that's what I'm saying, right? So, like, the scripted stuff. If it's scripted, it's take. There's a lot more that goes into it. Whereas, you know, I could just turn on the recording recorder and just go any day, but that's boring to me. Yeah, your friendly boyfriend. That's it. Um, <laughs> whenever, the con <laughs> whenever the conversation bores him, he goes right back to Outer Wilds. No, but that's just what I'm saying. Like, right? Like, I have to get away from that whole. My, my idea of a scripted let's play isn't actually a let's play, it's a scripted performance. But that's not even what I want to do either. So like in part three of my, of the Cheaty Paradox files, I kind of break it down more explicitly just saying you know, there's all the scripting that goes into it where you try to cover... It, there's a lot more work that has to go into covering absolutely everything very efficiently, right? Whereas, you know, just turning on the recorder and, you know, having an idea in your head of kind of where you want to go, it's just very different. One, you can do it in a day. The other, you know, you don't get done in a month. Lighthouse is one of those games you look back at and you're like, those were fun streams. Yeah, so I want to do some kind of polished scripted stuff, but you know, like I'm definitely B tier or C, C tier editing and stuff. Like, you can go on YouTube and find amazing people making crazy stuff all the time on a level that I can never do. But I also think I have my own style. So, like, people all often will have a lot of cuts, a lot of jump cuts every few seconds. I like to have these long, continuous videos playing. But even that's actually hard to pull off. That may look like I don't put a lot of thought into it, but it actually... I, I try to record just the right thing at just the right pace and never mess up and never do anything that really jars your attention, but also gets the exact point across. I mean, I cheated on Lighthouse because I had you guys around, I think. So, but the thing is, like, this is something I also explained in one of my other videos. It, it may take several dozen takes to get one of those. It, it's There's a lot of gameplay as video backdrop for a lot of... Com like, there are channels where it'll be, you know, some kind of socio-political commentary, and they'll just have gameplay footage playing in the background as just irrelevant bullshit. That's not what I'm doing. 
okay? There's actually a lot of thought to into exactly what game I'm playing and exactly what route I'm taking, exactly what music is playing in every single one of those moments. But I think on of it on a fundamentally different level. I try to make these long, continuous scenes. But it's not meant to be just something you don't pay attention to. If you, The more you pay attention to it, you'll see more how it actually matters to the content I'm producing. And that's kind of the, the struggle that I have is that I put all this work into it, but in this really weird, subtle way that is almost designed for you not to notice. So the real stuff I should be making is something that you do notice, but also doesn't fit any, I, I don't know. I don't want to be anything formulaic either. I can't put the red there because then you have red hit this and that's unacceptable. You have theories? This is puzzle K2, so it's very near the end of the game. If I solve three more puzzles, I'm at, I finish it. If Lauren shows up, that means I've streamed for too long. Yeah. See, I try to do this. Then that puts the green so far back, you can't do anything useful with it. See, you could put it, if the green could just not hit this and just continue and hit this. Right, and likewise, if this could, if this red could not hit this and just continue and hit this, that would be great. Two or four. Yeah, 
Yeah, see, if this didn't hit this, then this, this turquoise would hit this straight away. X would be done. And if this green didn't hit this, then this purple would hit that. And the X's would be done. And then when I flip this, what would happen? Never even worked on this side. You know what? I'm going to put a move up here. No way. That's not right. But let's do it anyway. Sometimes I just try just different symmetrical arrangements just to see if there's some other pattern that arises, but... crap nothing 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 good became of that okay try again <sighs> what's your theory tech rock you're still here give me the center now i can't <clears throat> i can't put anything on the white I've been drinking a lot, by the way. My eyes are half open. So there's also that. Yeah.
Oh, sure. I will tell you something about this game is that they do have whatever the solution is. It's probably very aesthetically pleasing. They tend to be, it, the, you can see how symmetric the puzzle is. You might think, oh, it might be an a asymmetrical approach. No. This is Rethink 3. This is my sixth game in this series because there's also Rethink Evolved. Yeah, it definitely goes for the symmetry, the aesthetic results. So just trying different symmetrical arrangements is wise. And also this this little funny post in the middle, it's um just to show the point. It does actually block laser beams. Just demonstrating that. See, I wanted originally to just put this because you need blue to hit these regardless, but then... Okay, so let's let's see. I mean, I don't know. I would be very kind of cautious with your idea. The reason I would be cautious is that you don't need to light them all up at once. You need to you need to light up only one symbol at a time. You flip it and then the other one lights up. And they do actually tend to be four zero, right? So one configuration will light all the X's up and none of the di of the diamonds. And then you flip it and all the diamonds light up and none of the X's. That's usually how these puzzles work. When I say usually... I can't think of it a single exception in six games. Except for the last puzzle I just played. Because I feel like I found some BS unintended solution. Um... I don't know. I mean, it would be interesting if it was something like this, right? Where... Right, you have this sort of thing, right?
Hmm. That's a pretty good indication that we're doing this entirely wrong. So this one's clear to hit this X, but that one's not clear to hit this X. This, yeah, because it's this one. So to <coughs> translate <coughs> the problem from a diagonal problem to one that's more around the right angles here. Because I did this, move these kind of out of the way to clear the way for this to hit that. I'm not feeling it now because when I do it over here, I do the symmetrical thing over here and that's the wrong one, right? If those were flipped, maybe. Hello? <sighs> Bug, I can't select anything. God damn it. Well, I gotta quit. <laughs> Yeah, I reset it while I had something selected, and I think that messed with it. Does the center switch flip the state of the lasers? No, it flips the state of these with the one over it, because the, the switch says toggle one. So the ones will point either left or right, and so you can get them all to point either to the left, or you can get them all to point to the right. And so you have to understand, like, when I put this here, right now, this one's pointing to the left, and this one's pointing to the left, and you're hitting X's at the same time. Get out of here. You're hitting X's at the same time, and it seems like you're off to a good start. And then I look at this turquoise coming through here, or this cyan coming through here, I guess. And it's like, I need blue to go this way. This is blue and red. This is blue and green. So I think I want... Oh, this is... Sorry. Yeah. You want green to get through, blue to come through. And now these are also half done. They don't light up, but these are half done. Right? And then I can put this... Over here, and these are half done. Alright, so then I got this stray red and this stray green and a bunch of spare blocks and it's like I just need to get these others to line up but they don't So I got two of four either way. Even this is kind of like two and a half though. If I want X, I want green to hit this. Which green is pathetic. Green is stuck way over here. Now I'd love to actually, looks like I got a green, but I got shit in the way. Otherwise, wait. Why is this one hit? 
Oh, because I ruined it. Huh. It's still two or four either way, but it's a different two or four. Huh. All right. So, yeah, when I have it out of the way, the two X's are the ones in the middle. If I put these... in the way then the two x's are the outer ones but i don't have all four at the same time now it'd be interesting if you actually could split them like this and they would just miss these that seems preposterous but okay see if I do that then suddenly I can hit that What? I don't know. This is stupid. I score literally zero <laughs> on both. <laughs> well, it was worth trying. No, it wasn't, but it was. I feel like I should probably do this next time. But I can still hang out if anyone's left. Who's left? I can do something. I feel like if I got three more puzzles, though, it'll take one more stream. This game's hard. It's really hard. I didn't say besides you. You count. You matter. Yeah. 
I think I'm gonna have to try this one next time. Um, just with a clear of mind. Uh, no regrets. Just saying. I'm gonna switch to a different logic game for just a few minutes. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you this other game. Oh, people are dropping out, we're only down to four. All right, people are getting bored, but that's fine. Or it's late, I don't know, don't care. I'll play a little bit. Um, Lauren said I'd be good at this game and I spent many hours on it. I think that she just played the easy mode. I don't think she did it. I only do hard mode. I'm gonna play this game. What happens if I dare to show this monitor? Okay, that's no good. What? <laughs> All right. Have a good rest, Sarah. All right. I'm just going to play a couple puzzles. Wind, probably wind this down soon, but I'm going to play a couple. All right. This will be a randomly generated puzzle. There's an achievement at 60. You could do it with easy mode. That's what I'm saying. Like, you could make... You can generate easy easy puzzles but i don't do that i'm not a pussy so I do hard puzzles okay you know these so this was a randomly generated puzzle for this stream uh, let's see let's see if i'm any good okay so here's a one that one means there's one on this column one meaning a blue cell we already have it so that means all these are what i would call because i'm a minesweeper player safe uh, see this, so that two, the ones inside the cells mean surrounding. So two out of the three, three out of four, three out of four. So you don't know these determinatively. Uh, this three with the braces means continuous. That they're all, that the three are surrounding it are all connected, but there are five. So that means the middle one is definitely, but then this one in turn gives you these. So now the three continuous are these. There you go. So that two gives you this. What happened to rethink? I got stuck. I'm going to try it next time. Uh, so it's a randomly generated puzzle, but it says Apparently, they, these are generated to where you're never actually stuck. We'll see. We'll see if I can actually figure this out. So likely, no one's ever seen this puzzle before. Why is that cut off right here? Oh, it sort of doesn't right there. Nobody cares though, right? I don't need to figure it out tonight. Not like Solitaire. Although if you go to, I think it's free. Well, this was as of like 15 years ago, back when I was a free cell addict. So like freecell.net, they could generate winnable Solitaire games. They were guaranteed winnable. One, two, three, four, five. I don't know.
So like right now, it looks like yeah, I have to guess because it feels like a Minesweeper game, but these are actually, well, they are randomly generated with this as a seed. Apparently they're done so in such a way that there is no way for it to be, to require you to ever guess. I think the solution is in this. So this six means that there are six along. When we talk, the blues you can think of as nine, as not nines, mines. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven spaces. That's it. I need to get another drink because I'm, I'm doing well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So six out of seven, they're all mines except one. The exception is clearly around this two. So this would be safe. One of those, these two are mines. That two, dun, da, da. okay. Um, There's that five. Oh, this. One, two, three, four, five. You're right. Okay, let's do that. Okay. And then that's done. Two, three here, right? Yeah. So here's my personal rule, by the way, before I move on. So in the base game, it you don't get full credit if you make two or more mistakes. So I just want to say, if I get two two mistakes I'll peace out and I'll just re I'll just start another puzzle I'll just abort I will, I will not take credit even if it would actually count it I won't count it one two three four one two three four Five, six. I don't know if I believe in that. One, one, one. Oh, four right there. One, two, three, four. So there's a fifth one in here. Yeah, the number inside, since you you obviously played Tegrak, you've played. But for any, anyone who hasn't, the numbers inside the blue cells are this weird two cell radius. One, two, three, four, five. Clearly, because this three. So then one of these three is would be the sixth one.
something that has to be going on with these. This, this five and this six. This three over two is seven. I don't know. Uh, two over three. Oh, no. Oh, there's nothing here. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is a weird situation because I would think that this I can't see anything like this six this two kind of point to these Everything's really ambiguous except for this situation right here, which seems murky. So there's something weird going on here If this is safe, then those two are mines. I, I consider blue to be a mine. So the way I like to think about it is, okay, so well, I'm not sure what the exact bifurcation would be. Something weird in here. Also, the viewers dropped way down, which I mean, because people aren't here for the, for me, they're here for the game, but also. But people weren't here for rethink. That's what's puzzling to me. have to try something so i do have these I was working on a puzzle before Let's see here yeah so like you can say you can take this and just guess like you can say hey if that was safe what happens right and you'd say well the, because of this two but then because of the six one two three four one two three four five six those would be safe so because of this four these would be mines i don't see anything wrong with this this five can't be both of these so it'd be one of these two
I think that's the issue. I think the issue is that because of this two, the, the lines mean that the two are separated, that you have a, at least one safe space in between them. So you can't have like both of these be blue and both of these be safe. And therefore, the fifth one here, right? One, two, three, four, five would be in here. Or that one is... I probably didn't even have to bifurcate this, honestly. Just the fact that this is a two split means one of these three, right? So it's one, two, three four, five, all these are safe. That's what it is. Yeah, I overthought that one. But then this two being connected, that's one of them. There you go. Now two split there, 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 and we're in business again. Okay. One, two, three, f one, two, three, four, five. Six, four. Two here. The one has to be those. This one is this. This three, therefore, is one, two, three. That gives you all this. Ooh, a five. Four. A one. Now what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's way too many. That's three. One of those three. That's two. Huh? What am I missing? Is there an extra clue? If this, then this. If this. Ah, that's a weird one. If this was blue, then because of this, these would both be black. If this was black, the safe, then the three would require both of these to be blue. So then you have these and that would violate this. Huh. Again, I'm overthinking this because I'm drunk. Two split. Can't be both of these split. So it has to be this. One, two, three. Yeah, that's all it is. Derp. Uh... Two out of three, two out of four. Could it be these two? 
those were safe and that why not one of these i don't know 12 does that come into play yet it seems a bit early If this is blue, that would be the third one here, right? So that would be safe. But then according to this, one, two, three. So you'd have these two be blue. If the, uh, under the root assumption, this is blue. Yeah, I'll just show you. I'll just do it this way. I, th I think I have something to here. I just want to show it formally. If... Hello, come on. If this is blue, then that's safe. Then according to this three, that's blue. This two would do this. And now you got a problem with this two. Yeah, it's a contradiction, so that's not. So that has to be safe. Split. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, it's still not. What? Huh? Three remain. Sorry. One, two, three, right? One, two, three, four, five. So that means everything else is safe. This one means that. All right. And there it is. Ha! Okay. All right. Let's do another rando. Hey, it's a small one. Must mean it's really hard. Somebody made a boner joke in there, but whatever. It doesn't really make sense. One, two, one. There aren't many clues here. 25. 1. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a one here. I didn't see his. Yeah. See, it doesn't logically make any sense. It's just people, you know, they, they find the keywords and try to make sense of it. So if one of these, so like this one right here, if one of these was blue, you see the problem with that? <laughs> if one of these is blue, then these would be safe. And therefore this three would be one, two, three. <laughs> so wait, which way did I? Hold on, I think it's this way. Yeah. All right.
one of these. But how do I continue? Two, three. I don't think it's that one. If this is... No. See, like, even this four is pretty expensive, right? So this two, one of these, but... I mean, come on. One, two, three, four, five. Three of the remaining five? Oh, there's a four right here. One, two... <laughs> Sometimes there's just a clue where I'm just I just don't see it. <laughs> um So you definitely saw it before. Fortunately I saw it before I saw your comment, but you definitely saw it. Saw the actual thing before I saw the thing. Oh yeah, and now you definitely saw that, okay. But how much have you had a drink tonight? I have that going for me too. <laughs> One, two, three, okay. A nine, that's weird. Yeah, it includes this too. You got three out of the four. One, two, three, four, If it was down here, then those would be both safe and you'd have to have all three of these. But that's nothing actually wrong with that, right? Oh, one, two, three, four, five. Four of the remaining six? I mean, come on. tired as well so let's look at this is there anything weird if that if you call that 
like that. Does anything weird happen? One, two, three, four, five. And you still got four out of these five. Nothing is known about these. So you could have a blank in here or maybe not. So you don't know anything about this. None of this seems to say anything. I guess if you... Do it the other way. No, that's even more unknown, right? Because then you got six. You got three out of the five. Hmm. One, two, three, four. You know what? I think it actually is the fact that it's, there's seven left. Nine minus four. There's five in here and two up there. So everything else is safe. What? I miscounted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I miscounted. Let me restart this. Even where I was wrong, I mean, even where I was right, I was wrong. Even where I was right, I don't like to count those. The fact that it counted things correctly when I was, my logic was wrong. The two was next to one, so it was only one of those, and so. Yeah. I have to start over if I'm going to count this one. That's my own personal rule. I didn't have to, but... Mm, Got to remember how I did it. Uh... It was this, right? It's something else. Three. Oh, three. All right, that's where I was. Try again. It revealed where it was, but I don't care. I want to know what the actual argument is. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So then five of the remaining ones are in here. So then there are two. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yep. 
So my logic would have been sound, but I counted this two as if it applied two of these three. That's not true because you got one. I, I miscounted this whole thing, but that changes everything actually. Sometimes my logic is fine, but then like my just observation is shit. This two, one of these three. So if this was blue, then this would actually be, these two would be blank. And therefore these two and that would violate it. Yeah, there you get that that way. See, I didn't, I didn't connect this two with that. I, so I was thinking two of these three. That's, that's, that's what I did wrong. And that's, that was stupid. All right, now count them up. One, two, th one, two, three, four, five, six. So all three remain in there, right? So now you can do, there you go. All right, you don't even need that anymore. All right. Let's do one more. That was very unsatisfying. Ooh, a zero. Hold on, this six, one, two, three, according to this, four, according to this, five, so therefore six, and therefore one, two, so that'll give you these. Oh, you're just saying this straight away. One, two, three, four, five, six. If this then If this is oh. I'm going to make this formal. I think it's a simple argument, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to do it in a very formal way because I don't want to make mistakes anymore. All right. So if this is. like this then the three would be completed therefore you have this whereas
Right? So, like, there's this funny thing where both of those are mines either way. And more importantly, this is always safe? In both scenarios, that was safe, so that gives me this. Four remaining. One, two, three, four. There you go. <laughs> Still too easy. Give me a harder one. Whatever this is. Two. It's got to be both of those, right? This two means one, two, so. One, two, three. You need that so you don't get either of these. Oh, okay. I'll give me that. That to give me that. And you have this. One, two, three. Whoa, that's interesting. Wait a minute, it has to be the two. It's broken up. Look at this six. Versus the two, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The one that's missing has to be here. So you got to get all these. And I'll give you that. Mm. What? <laughs> Why didn't that give me as much as I thought it would? Okay, hold on. I got this and this. I could just remind myself of all the open lanes, even though it looks kind of cluttered. I don't know.
One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's a lot. Although I guess you get at most one of these. I think this is safe for whatever that's worth, because if this is, if this is safe, then to split two, that's got to be a mine and to complete the six, that's got to be a mine. So if this is safe, then it's, then the two is these two. If this is a mine. Then that has to be safe because it's not consecutive. So either way, that's got to be safe. I don't know if that means anything. <laughs> Two. This is one of them. If this is a mine, then that's safe. I think of him in terms of mines, but my, my head is not clear right now. If this is. This is a mine. Then that's a mine. This is a mine. Okay, if this is a mine, then that's a mine. If this is a mine, then that would finish. Either way, this one is safe. But in, in both scenarios, that one was safe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, still too many. One of the... So this, this two split from the six. You got one of these, and therefore one of those... If this is a mine, then it would have to be this. Can you go with this and this? Is that viable? Let's try that. I don't know. 
Right, that being a mine. I can't keep it in my head. And I don't know if I actually need this level of bifurcation, but... Again, I'm on... on fumes at this point. If that's a mine, then according to the two... Yeah, you can see it on the stream. Yes. Okay. Those would be saved. Then that. This six would be done. This two would be done. This two would require these two. This four. Ah, there's a contradiction. You have a three. Okay. So that one would be safe. There we go. One, two, three, so that's safe. <sighs> One, two, three, still the same. One, two. Oh, there's a two right here in the middle. Derp. Five is still not satisfied. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's weird hearing that stereo on the right. Five remain. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two. Oh, no. What? Oh, okay. This three, this, this three implies one remains on this column. This four implies one remains on that column. So of these five, there are two left. Well, this five will claim one of them. This one or this three will claim the other one. So that's going to be safe regardless. And continuing in that train of thought. This two must point to this and this, therefore that's safe. One, two, three, four, five. That gives you that. And that's that one. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, these are fun. I'm almost there. But I may have to do it next time. Do the rest next time or well, next time. I don't know. Logic puzzles are fun. I never know what the interest level really is of these things, but. I'm going to have to get some sleep now. Yeah, it's one in the morning. I guess you're the only one left at least chatting tech rock. So it was good to hang out with you. But um, yeah. That's going to be it for me tonight. Ooh. Let's turn that off so I don't dox myself for something dumb. Maybe you live next door to me. I don't know. Well, you, you see my Texas flag. I don't actually know where you live, but. um, Yep. All right. There you are, Moss. Wisconsin. Yeah, that's a, that's a drive. But I-35, right? Um, yep. All right. Night. Good night, Tech Rock, and good afternoon. Mostap and whoever else. Yeah. I almost have the achievement for that. I'll continue it some other time. I, I, I don't know. It's actually not the worst thing to stream it. At least the end of that achievement. But yeah. All right. Good night. <laughs>